Hey guys, D-Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Odyssey. Last time, we meandered around town, got some random moons. We were able to get things going and find out that Mayor Pauline needs a little bit of our help putting a band together for a city celebration. So we're going to help with that. We actually have run into a couple of these people already. And I hope that the flag for them joining the celebration is already queued up. I think it is. Oh, yeah. Look at this suit. Beautiful. My favorite color. Okay. So he knows that the mayor doesn't hesitate to get the cache out. If you do something well, viewers, don't do it for free. Okay, so I'm assuming... Do we get a moon for every single one of these? And do we have to come back and do this every time? Yes, that's right. With nothing but the allure of cold hard cash. Thanks. I would really enjoy not having to come back here every time. We will see. There's actually one right here. Just convenient. Gene Croup on the drums. Here we go. Why is that? Is it because you weren't being paid enough? This guy seems a little bit more... respectful. He's just in it for the enjoyment. Just banging on the drums. Two down, two to go. Okay, great. <laughs> that is really unnecessary, especially considering that wherever we find these people, um, they may or may not be even remotely close to that space so those were the two that I knew right away also ignore the poorly frame rated NPCs in the background as you get a little bit closer to them it clears up a little bit but looking a little bit like a PowerPoint slide okay well let's meander around and see who we can find so we have a drummer we have a guitarist maybe there's somebody around that can toot the old horn what if we use this moped to get around? Maybe this will speed up our journey. Just kind of driving right back to where we were already. So a little pointless, but whatever. Oops. Whenever I think of things like this in like a bigger city, obviously you'll probably think of like your Grand Theft Autos. Um, but I also think of the game Crazy Taxi. Does anybody remember Crazy Taxi? Back in the day, I was one of the few kids in my neighborhood who I didn't have an Xbox or a PlayStation, nothing like that. Nothing fancy and cool because it didn't have the monies. But I did get a Dreamcast eventually. What a time to be alive. The future was now. The Dreamcast, the console of the future. I honestly don't know where any of these other people are. Um... I couldn't tell you. I probably should have done a little bit of research, but I forgot. This looks promising. What's under here? Is there a moon? At least... Okay, coins. We'll take that. Ooh, where's this go? Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know where anything is. So, very much a hide-and-seek. Oops. Could have got more coins up there, but I missed. We're just going to continue to explore around. I wonder if... It would have been cool if the game would have given you a hint. And maybe there was a hint from Pauline. But I totally goofed on that one and did not pay attention. Where is that music coming from? Is this a hint? Maybe up on the high rise? Let's see. I don't remember this door being open before... Ooh. Okay, game, can you just... Okay, little moped. Oh, there's a dinosaur. What is happening? Oh, look at its cute little goggles. Oops. How am I supposed to avoid this? I'm assuming the obstacles are... in the way. Ooh. It's a good place to get coins if you have it. Whoa! What a cool little doodly-doo! Oh, missed that moon. 
And I have all these lives, so I won't be able to really go back and get it. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> the motor scooter. I would love to go back and redo that. So I did a very poor job. What happens if I kill myself here? Wee! Can I do it again? I'm probably not going to remember even where that moon was. We can! Beautiful! All right. Saved by death. Here we go! Wee! Another chance to grab some of the purple coins as well. Not that it honestly matters. Stop trying to give me the old charm. Yeah, exactly. I think I remember the moon being kind of screen left here. Oops. Gotta be kind of more careful here. Ooh, there we go. It's kind of more this way. I don't need you to leave me alone. A minute for the moon. Oh, no. <laughs> I will get it. I do know that it's on the left side at least, so that's good. So the goal is to get this moon, which means nothing, and to eventually find out if there's a musician up on the rooftops. We love our rooftop bars, don't we, viewers? The side of the city. What is that? Is that just the dinosaur making that sound? That That is horrible. I don't like it. Give me alone. Jurassic Park was a good movie. I got it, woo! The big jump escape. Rolling around at the speed of zoom. Oops. Oh no, no, no! Oh wait, this is intended. Oh, that's so sad. You don't really get to see him die like that. How did it get in here? Where did it get dinosaur sized goggles? Viewers, I have so many questions. That's okay. Also, I probably should have kept the moped because that was a bit of a jaunt. But that's okay, we're inside now. Soft and warm. That's all that was, great. I mean, that was kind of cool though. I need to get up on top of this building now. How do I get up here? I don't remember anymore. Uh, can I jump from one to the next? There's gotta be a way to get up there. How do I get up here? I don't know anything. Story of my life. All right. I don't think that there's anything to do. Wait, can I capture this taxi? I don't remember honestly how you get, how you um, fix this. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, and I'm not gonna bother anymore. All right. Um. Hey, I'm moving here. Stereotypical accents and stuff. Interrational. Downtown city anger. All right. Um, all right. Well, this is a way up to this side, but it doesn't get me up to the other side. I'm assuming the game is supposed to be giving you cues on how to do this. Oh, there we go. Whoop. All right. Now, how do I get? Oh boy. Oh, no, that was my chance. There's this fire escape. There we go. Starting to kind of lose sense of where I was going, though. Okay. We're back at it. Cleaned it up. Um... Yeah, there's somebody playing, playing them keys over here. No, I need to learn how to do the jump. All right. That is the gambling. You don't want to do the gambling. Uh, Mario? <laughs> What's going on here, bud? Yeah, I do not know where I'm going. Full disclosure, I do not. Um, I will figure out eventually. Is there something over there? No. That's the rocket ship. I can hear it. I can hear them keys. I wonder if it would have been smart to actually do what the game told me instead of ignoring it. It's kind of like what I do when I buy a set of Lego, which I don't... I mean, I haven't done that in a long time, but it's, you know, at one point I did. Let's talk to Polly and see if she gives a hit. Yes! Yes! Oh. Okay, great. Absolutely no help. Also, these people are fully dressed for this concert. Good for them. Okay, 
So, if I ever want to feel like a tourist. Does anybody really want to feel like a tourist? I mean, I thought the end goal eventually was to kind of blend in so you don't get like, you know, robbed, stuff like that. Oh, hey, I'm a local. I do remember hearing a story from a friend once that said, and this is kind of more, um, is that Captain Toad? This is probably more advice for women, obviously, because the world is dangerous and people are creeps, but um, she was saying that like when you go to places, if you're traveling, to make yourself very much sound like a local for your safety. So definitely do that. Aw, thanks, Captain Toad. You came all the way to the big city just for us? How you doing, Captain Toad? How you doing? He's doing pretty good, I guess. They sure do. Concrete jungle there, Captain Toad. Get used to it. Welcome to the big city life. Oh. Yeah, just kind of a neat little uh, detour, I suppose. Would really love to find those other musicians, though. Wait, what are you saying? Great source of urban energy. Is there anybody up here? Oh, wait. Who are you? I see you over there. You're playing a little horn. Ooh, how do I get to you, though? I think if I go up higher, I might be able to long jump to that. That's what I thought. There's a trumpet player. A little toot, toot, toot. He's tooting his horn. There we go. Let's get on up. I want to go up all the way. Yes. Okay. Now, where are you? I can see your, your magic. Maybe if I jump from here, this looks very scary. It's like uh, playing the new Zelda after a while. Um, oh boy. Jumping from those sky islands. Spoilers. Um, those are pretty vertigo inducing. We'll say that. All right. Got another one. Didn't realize they had little beacons of rainbow light. Groovy hat man. Thank you. Yeah, whatever happened to calling people cats? Come on. Okay. It is nice that they give you a moon for every single one of these. Not really necessary, per se. There we go. It's another one down. We have certainly surpassed the amount of moons we needed. All right, I don't know. It's got to be a singer, right? Unless that's Pauline, so maybe we need a bass player. Slab the bass. Yeah, they do have... Oh, I can see it now. The beacon. Oh, is it just... Oh, beautiful. They hook you up with a... Quick jaunt over here. Oh, love that. What is this? Uh, what is this? Looks like a Bowser robot. I've always felt a kinship with birds. Are you the lady from Home Alone 2? It's a deep cut. Shouldn't be. There it is. Labadabase. Musical mission. Yes, we are. From Ms. Pauline. See, they're doing it out of the kindness of their hearts. That guitarist was greedy. He's like, I'm not freelancing. I only do paid gigs. I mean, I guess freelancing is paid gigs, but you know, I'm not doing it for free. I'm not free lancing. You should consider running for public office, but the amount of people that think that everybody's qualified for that, it wouldn't surprise me if people would write in Mario for voting. Oh, the power supply to the festival. She doesn't surprise where... Not surprise. She doesn't suppose... And we did see that trying to get underground was something that was made difficult by virtue of uh, this car being in the way. It looks like it has somehow disappeared. Let me ask you something. I'm not entirely sure you're the kind of person that I would imagine would inspect that, but here uh, we are. Taking presence of an inanimate object. The underground power. Oh. Viewers. We might just have enough time today. Oops, probably should have gone back. Wait, 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 wait. There's a little walkway here that I completely ignored. There's gotta be something over here, right? Is it just coins that I don't care about? Come on, game. Give me the good to to do. Something fun. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm assuming that 
given the nature of what we're trying to do, we'll we'll take care of the of the business today, and then we'll get to the fun stuff in the next episode. Although, I mean, this is of course absolutely fun. So don't uh, don't get things crossed. All right, viewers. Yeah, take that. Spitting your goo at me. Your purple goo. This looks like the goo from the Power Rangers movie. Does anybody remember that? With Ivan Ooze. A classic. Rest in peace, the one characters. I think the old guy who's the White Ranger, I think he died. So, rest in peace, White Ranger. Rangers! Alright. Ooh! Apparently we are able to cause these to move just with the power of Cappy. Get this goo out of here. And these nasty boogs. Ah, oh, yes. Bring me back to life. I can't wake up. All right. No, no. Yes, no, wait. There's things up there. I want to get the things and stuff. All right, hold on. Stop, quit. Oh, did I make it? No, I didn't make it. Oof, the perspective on that had me thinking I did. All right, let's try this again. Come on. What am I doing? Ooh, save myself, viewers. This is getting a little crazy. All right. It's like, it's not... <laughs> the perspective is kind of throwing me off. Oh, it only has so much juice. Needs more, Sunny D. All right. There we go. Only 17 tries. We made it. Always got to look for those hidden moons. So my nickname in high school, Sewer Treasure. Oops. And the goo. Oh. This episode is all about references to things from my past. AKA every episode. All right, here we go. This one moves really fast. That's what throws me off a little bit. Just gonna kind of ignore these boys. Oh wait, there's, wait. Ugh, I want to, I just want to just move on, but I can't when I see the stuff and the things and I'm just like, oh yeah, I get it. Is it just coins? Viewers, is it just coins? Is it worth it? It's probably not worth it. But don't leave it. Uh... Oh, I need cap for this. You know what? Screw it. We're moving on. Oh, no, don't say... Oh! That was bad news. We got some... Oh, no. Okay. Well, you didn't have to see it that time. You just have to assume that Mario died there. We got a lot of work to do. Unfortunately, we don't have time to goof around. We're on the clock, viewers. We're working hard. So the man can go on his extra vacations. Although I guess this doesn't really make as much sense because we're working for the city, sort of. Maybe we're not a government employee. Maybe we're a private contractor. I don't know. Yeah, ooh, I didn't know you could do that. Give him the, oof, this is bad. Give him the boot. Bam. Stay away from me. This is getting a little precarious. Oh no. Please, stop. Ooh, no, please, quit, no, quit, stop. I need to alert the cap, jump. I don't know how to do it. <laughs> oh, viewers, I need to learn the cap jump. The amount of times in this series alone that I would have been able to save myself from sheer destruction. I mean, I can, I can do the, the cap recalibrate, recalibrate. That works pretty well. Oh boy. Yeah, bug off. Ha, huh. you see what I did there viewers? That's a good one, right? Yeah, I'm just gonna take it slow and steady instead of trying to be too fancy. I'm fancy. I'm the first one to scream on the track. Actually, the the word is bossy, but fancy fit because of what I was saying. Uh oh, Pauline, how'd you get down here? You beat us. She probably knows the secret tunnel. Oh, look at that. See, she's experiencing civic duty firsthand. She's working for the people all on her own. Very nice. All right, so this is, we got to kill these big piranha plants. And boop, got them. Easy pee. Oops. Covering you in great drink. All right. And the moon powers itself. These <laughs> the the workers cowering in the distance. I don't want to get go in my suit. 
You definitely don't want to get you in your suit. We did it though. Station powered up. Is that good enough? I feel like that's not supposed to be there. It's like break glass in case of emergency. Time to fire it up, you bet. We're gonna butt stomp this button. Boop. Energy. The power moon. How sustainable is that? Is it renewable? Are there power moon lobbyists in New Donk City? We did it. Oh yeah. Maybe next time. Well, that is 100% true, and that's what we will do next time. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Mario Odyssey, and I'll catch you next time for the festival. Bye.